dead after agreeing to help. This is 23-year-old D'Angelo Mitchell of North Charleston. Investigators want to charge him now with involuntary manslaughter. ABC News Force Nikki Gaskins explains why. Dean, it started with a traffic stop for a busted headlight and ended with a young man dead from what police say was a drug overdose. And what was initially one man's attempt to avoid trouble ended in tragedy. You're watching video from November 30th of D'Angelo Mitchell, pictured on the right, begging his younger brother, Wayne Mitchell, to adjust cocaine located down his backside. His older brother is supposed to love his little brother and take, have his back take good care of him. And when you see this thing, you'll see that's not what was going on in that car. According to Police Chief John Zumalt, D'Angelo repeatedly asked his brother over and over again to get rid of the drugs or he'll never get out of prison. Wayne eventually gives in. D'Angelo then reaches into the back of his pants to pull out the cocaine. Once Wayne gets it, he lowers his head into his lap, ingesting the drug. Not long after doing so, Wayne dies. His cause of death is known to be acute cocaine toxicity. He died as a result within an hour of eating that cocaine so his older brother wouldn't have to take the charge and go to prison. Instead, one brother is now dead and the other nowhere to be found. Less than an hour before his death, Wayne expressed his loyalty to his older brother for a final time. I love you, bro. Now, the angel bailed out of jail on December 1st on drug charges. Police are hoping to find him so they can now charge him with this latest crime. Nikki Gaskins, ABC News 4. And the angel